What's up, Kerbal Knots? This is Noel on PC, and obviously today we're playing KSP again. In the last video, we attempted a landing on an aircraft carrier, and that turned out to be completely futile. Uh, as you can see at the very end here, I've installed this sort of catch bar, but even still, that didn't work either. <laughs> it just went right through it, like it wasn't even there. So I thought, well, what if we just put some planes on it, and at least then we could we could do the fun part of taking off because I mean that's that's gonna be a hoot so I used a couple of Clampatron juniors and a couple of struts to basically strap some of our F-18s down and I thought we would give it the old college try and see if we can't take one off I have no idea what's gonna happen one of two things you know awesome or kablamo gonna be sketchy as hell okay we're gonna decouple and then I'm gonna quickly switch to it and then try and get the landing gear down uh, oh god brakes on good okay good Whew. it worked I was worried we were gonna end up in the drink for obvious reasons let's activate these engines okay well that's a shame I have to manually change the motors between their various modes. That's not that's not gonna be good. I want the wheels to go over this knob. I can already tell that that would be a good idea. Otherwise I'll get this craft stuck and I can't back it up. There we go. Beautiful. Almost like I knew what I was doing. I have not tested this yet. I have no idea what's going to happen. I don't know if the, the wheels are even going to work on the... Uh, like, we know that they can sort of slow down. We saw that in the previous video. But whether or not they can actually, like, speed up and at the rate that we kind of need them to speed up... <laughs> okay, I would say that's probably good enough because we don't want that wing to clip. Oh, it definitely won't. Let's go a little, let's go a little bit further. Just a wee bit. A wee bit more. That's good enough. We'll go right off the end. Yep. Perfect. Okay. Whew. Moment of truth, right? Alright. I think my, I think the engines are going to hurt that? Probably not. Okay. We're going to throttle up. This goes wet to dry, but I don't have a button for it. If I try and toggle like that, one of those engines is going to be pushing a lot harder. It's going to turn us. We're going to go in the drink. So I think my best bet probably is to gather up speed with the dry and then pop like one wet just as we go off the end. Once we're sort of in the safety zone near the end there, I think that's probably going to be the way to do it. Okay. Sorted. Sorted. We're going to build up a little bit of thrust, maybe. Let's do a little test. Is this going to push? Okay, let's just do it. Here we go. Here we go. It's happening. It's happening. It's twerking. Oh, yes! That was pretty awesome, right? It worked. That's a, that's a big plus. Most of the things we do don't. Oh, that was wicked. That was wicked. Let's do a quick flyby. Because we have to go land this now. We can't actually land this thing on there. Well, I guess... Uh, we could try. And we could try. But you know... You'll know it's not going to go well. If we, if we try and land this on there, we know what's going to happen. It's going to go down the runway. It's going to hit the plane at the end. And because the, the nose is a fuel tank, kablammo. Even if it hits at like 10 meters a second, it's going to just explode in just a ridiculous fireball. That was a cool stall. Is this going to come back on? Are we, are we out of fuel? Or, what's going on? Ha 
<laughs> I was trying to. You all saw me do that and was like, is he gonna notice that he turned off the engines and not toggled the mode? What the fuck is wrong with this guy? I thought he had a YouTube channel. I thought he was supposed to know what he was doing. All right. Let's just let's just put this thing down. I should probably at some point move that carrier farther away. It seems really close. Because we you never want it too close. Like I want this thing like way out at sea. So it never comes into the draw distance really. So it's just like an artifact. We can leave it there, but it'll never get loaded in really. Because that is a frame killer. <laughs> that is ridiculous. When you're right there, I was getting about nine ten. Now that we're out back up to 60 and I've got it I think frame locked at 60 so I'm sure it would be significantly higher we are going way too fast just trying to move around a lot trying to shut off a bunch of speed probably should have put the brakes down earlier that would have helped significantly okay I'm gonna put her down definitely won't need the parachute boink Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. When you have this thing, I forgot to turn that back to disabled. When you have that steering on, any little movements cause the front end to pitch and weave all over the place. It gets kind of sketchy. It's cool for shits and giggles. Yay! Wee! Awesome. I like it. I like it a lot. That carrier is awesome. What they need though is they need like an actual flight deck piece. You know, like some things big big things modular that you could sort of put together that would actually make a surface that the wheels can go over they also need to fix wheels wheels still seem really broken i feel like they slide all over the place unnecessarily friction i think it comes down to like a friction issue because you see it with landing legs if you land something with landing legs on say that aircraft carrier if, you, if you've got any lateral horizontal speed It'll just sort of like land and then just keep sliding almost like it's on an ice, you know, on ice skates and it just slides off the carrier. So they need to address like the friction and the wheel issue soon because it's game breaking the way it is right now. Uh, guys, I'm going to call it here. I hope you like the video. I hope you comment. I hope you uh, get inspired to build a similar ridiculous aircraft carrier and I hope it works out for you better than it did for me. All right, guys, until next time, peace, love, cheers.